It's early. It's uh, it's really early. We're going to McDonald's. I've got the sickest hat on planet Earth on right now, and I'm feeling good. Oh, it's happening today. Is that pink monster? Yeah, it is. What, what is that? It tastes good. Does it actually taste yeah, good? Yeah, it tastes really good. All right, I'm gonna try it next time. Northwest wind. I'll say I can set the decoys out like this at an angle. They come in over that CRP somehow, and we hunt out darks. Oh yeah, yeah. You about oh, got you, you got, got a quarter got inch. Oh, yeah. Is it doing anything? Yeah. No. I did it last year. All right, Bobby. What kind of what kind of MacGyver rigger we got going? Uh, on here? we're MacGyvering the hell out of this. This is. Just a front blind that we're going to be tucked behind. We're going to get a bunch of these weeds, lay under this tree, sit under the tree. And uh, we do this quite often with these T-posts on the edge of fields instead of laying out in the middle of it when it's green or no cover. Post there, you guys saw us nailing those in earlier. Basically a big blind we're going to hide behind. We've got a few trailers filled with decoys that we're kind of getting set up. So it's about a 7 seven eleven, and uh, we are getting set up. Pretty much everything's kind of coming coming into uh, coming together. We're getting all the decoy set up. We're getting all the blinds set up. It's fixing to be a pretty good morning. Like I said they don't. They've been saying they've been flying in the afternoon, so it may be kind of a slow morning. We may not see a whole lot of birds, but this afternoon we're we're gonna shoot a bunch. We got Wade out here directing traffic, right? Nope. Is that your job? That's oh, what? that's Ford's job. <laughs> So we're, what, what's the decoy setup looking like? Are we just kind of just spreading them around? You got a strategy behind all this, or you just kind of just hope? Kind of throw them, throw them wherever and everywhere. Pray for the best. There you go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. They so, want to see a thing. So Not tell, thing. tell the fans at home how you picked that spot. See, like, that's just, that's just the juice. You know, fishing's got juice. That's the juice for hunting. We got freaking Paul Bunyan over here taking out the Amazon rainforest. Right now we're we're moving we're moving the trucks. Sun is coming up. It's gonna be a good day. It's it's nice and frozen. My face is pretty much numb, but hopefully, hopefully we kill something. Yeah. We are leaving the. Uh, little fort we made here it is 11 o'clock and it's cold and I look like a tree and we're gonna go get food two hours later we made it back to our spread and there's nothing flying there's a lot of squirrels up in the trees and so we are gonna make squirrel biscuits and gravy yeah so we're making squirrel if, if Flair can hit one he doesn't he doesn't think I can hit anything we'll see I'm taking a shotgun for their head you gotta aim for the head and uh, this should be interesting. I don't know where they went. We, uh, we're still hunting. Still have not seen anything. On a cool slash side note, I flew my drone into a cloud of blackbirds. Scared me to death, but looked, looked pretty cool on, on the camera. But it's actually game time. Like we knew they were not going to fly in the morning. Reason being is because it's cold. Uh, that's usually what happens when it's cold. So they just they just don't fly. They fly when they need food, which is usually in the evening. So it's warming up. They should be hungry. It's game time. Bobby. Dose? Two Canada's baby. Dose gooseies. Well, what do we shoot? Three? three? Oh, we got three. We got one down there. Good work, boys. 
Those came yeah, in, buddy. Those came in perfect. Let's keep it up. Poor kennel. <laughs> So we are ending the hunting day. It is sunset, as you can see clearly. But we shot one, how many, nine, ten? Uh, we got nine here. Those guys are finding some cripples way down so there. So they're down in Narnia trying to find some other ones. We got nine here. So I mean, we shot maybe maybe a dozen. We should have shot a lot more. I don't know how good the footage was. Um, we had about 2,000 of them come really close to us, like really close. And uh, of course, both us and I got really greedy and just gr grabbed our guns and started shooting. So I know you probably saw a little bit of that. Probably should have just kept the camera in my hand and got cool footage, but you know, we drove all the way out here. I wanna, I'm a hunter, I'm not just a filmmaker. So I had to take a shot, but overall had a good time. We gotta, we gotta pick all of these, all these decoys up, all freaking 3,000 of them. I don't know how many freaking decoys there are, but so we gotta spend probably the next hour picking, maybe 34, 30 to 40 minutes picking those up and then head home, chillax, edit some vids. But overall, it was, uh, it was a pretty good day. The next day. God. Well, folks, it is two, like 15 or so. I haven't picked up the camera in a very long time. We went to Jimmy John's, as you guys saw, and uh, scouted birds for like three, four hours or so. Now we are getting the trailer full of decoys. We basically, just like I said, we scouted, we drove around and looked at birds flying for four hours. That's what that's what it takes to do this. But what, okay, I'm gonna stop talking. We're gonna set up decoys. We gotta set up layout blinds. We're filming tonight and uh, hopefully we're gonna shoot a bunch of geese. Yeah.
Yeah! Oh shit, Dark's coming in, baby. We're not killing a lot, we sure are getting... Oh, there you go. Get him, four. There you go! Woo! Look at all them birds. Show them the snow again. And then we got we got a lucky snow. I've never I didn't shoot that, but I've never I've never like been around the been shot. Bobby Guy shot this one. You shoot I that did. one, Bob? I did. You got that. I did. Nice dude. That's awesome. Yeah. Snow geese are sweet. So yeah, we uh shot a few chickens today. Not, not a bad day in the field. Good. Yeah. Well, folks, that is the end of the Goose Slang Massacre 2017 in Kansas. So today, Mr. Austin and I, we are doing a lot of redneck stuff. We're riding, riding side by sides, blowing stuff up, and then goose hunting later. But that is for the next video. For this video, we are going to end it here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the epic video. If you guys want to see more goose hunting, like like slang geese, just like tornadoes. Go over to Bobby's channel. I linked it down below. He's going to be putting out a lot of fire. He also does a lot of fishing. So, I mean, if you're just an outdoorsman, you should probably check it out. He's going to be coming out with a lot of stuff. And I'll be back very, very soon. We've got plans to do hillbilly hand fishing and a lot of other fun redneck things. But, like I said, if you enjoyed the goose hunting, you want to see more, uh, Austin and I, we can come back. We can come back in like a couple weeks, yeah. shoot some more. So, if you like it, leave a thumbs up and drop a comment down below. Let me know. Because if you like it, We'll drive down there. It's only like four an hour, four, four and a half hour drive. So it's not bad. So if you guys like it, let me know because I will come back and do it again. It was a lot of fun. It was a, it was just, it was a ton of fun. So like I said, if you wanna, if you wanna see more, go follow Bobby. That's all I've got. Thanks for watching. Peace.